Hey everyone, welcome to the Curious Girl Diaries podcast. I'm Layla London, aka The Curious Girl. Now just to let you know, this podcast is not suitable for work. It's also not suitable for anybody under 18. But the rest of you consenting adults, let's get ready to talk about my sex life, sex in general, and everything in between in explicit, raunchy, fun detail. All right, here we go. No, it was not. It was not. It was not. It was not a big penis. We got into the bed, yeah. and he pulled his dick out, and, and he talks dirty. He's like, a dirty talker. Marianne, you have an interesting sex toy story, right? Because um, didn't you have a dildo that exploded in you? Yes, I did. Uh, hey, guys. Well, I have a surprise. It's not me alone. I know I talked about this a long time ago, having my girlfriends on the podcast. A couple gals couldn't make it, but we do have... We have the naughtiest, dirtiest little sluts here, so that's all that we care about. Um, and and tonight's, tonight's theme is, we're they're using code names. Um, you guys already know my name, Layla London, of course, and we have Ginger and Marianne. So for those of you that aren't up to speed on that, that's from Gilligan's Island. All right. Are you, are you two naughty girls ready? All right. So I want to talk, first thing I want to know ladies mm-hmm. is mm-hmm. well first I want to talk about ginger sex from last night yes and this morning because, well oh you had it this morning too I did I did I did have it this morning okay so what do we want to talk about well do I we want, want to know, talk about give me the overall lay of the land and then I'll interject with questions so <laughs> <laughs> okay was it big? I in, no, it was not. It was not. It was not. Okay. It was not a big. When you pulled, it was not a big. Penis. When there was the big reveal, were you however, disappointed? however, were you disappointed? The, here's the thing. It was with somebody that I've known for a really, really long time, <laughs> and so there was a certain amount of anticipation. Yeah. And I went to his house, and I knew that we were gonna have. Sex, yeah, and I've had sex with him before. Oh, okay. So you already knew what you were. I, right. I kind of did. I oh, kind of remember, okay. but maybe not. All right. I kind of forgot for just a second yeah. until okay. he pulled his dick out. And I have just, I just went through a breakup, so I was feeling kind of like, okay, I just went through a breakup, and I'm gonna rekindle with a guy from 20 years ago. Yeah. And so it's the first time that I've been to his house. And so I went to his house and I was a little bit like, okay, I'm kind of yeah. tired, but whatever. Okay, we got there. Fast forward to the sexy part. Okay. We got into the bed. Yeah. And he pulled his dick out. And, and? he talks dirty. Really? Dirty. What did he say? He's like, a dirty talker. I, you, you know, I want to fuck you, and I know, I, you know, you want your my fucking cock in you. Oh. Blah blah blah. What did you say? Anyways, what did yes. You say back? Put your cock in me right now. So I was super horny. He has a small dick, but it doesn't matter because it was really, really hard. Yeah. And oh, so he fucked hard me. Is good. Hard, hard is good. good. Yeah. Hard is good. Yeah. Actually, a very hard dick is actually a really a, good a, thing. A super hard we dick. We need it. It has long, to be kind of hard, right. a you guys. Long, long semi flaccid. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 So yeah. if okay. you need to do Viagra or Cialis, do Whatever. it. Whatever. Do it. Because That's it does good. need to be hard. Hard makes all the difference. I'd like to make a point right now. Thank you. Yeah. Guys. Because it's mostly guys that listen to this podcast. Listen, if your wiener isn't working the way it's supposed to, you know, your wiener is the canary in the coal mine. I would like to give a PSA right now. If it's not as hard as it should be, go to the fucking doctor. It doesn't matter. We don't, we don't give a shit. I don't care if you're taking. I don't care. Dollars. Go to Mexico, wherever. <laughs> Just get you can get it for in Mexico. <laughs> we yeah. want a Just fucking rock hard. Yeah. Penis. Okay. Get some medicine. Yes. Like, like, doctor in Mexico, get, just get some fucking medicine. Yeah. So okay. it was it was a small penis, but it was uh, really hard. Yeah. And okay. he talks dirty. I love dirty talk. I love so dirty talk. let me yeah. tell you, a woman does not want to have a silent man. You yeah. need to you need to Make talk to her. Noise. I know. You yes. need to talk about what your dick's going to do to her. You need to talk about her, how her clit Very fills, good. how her vagina fills. Yes. Like, fucking fuck her and make That's sure your right. dick is hard. That's and he right. did it. It was small, but mm-hmm. it worked. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. And then he fucked me again in the morning. There you go. And it yeah. was good. Yes. It was good. Was I, it he pinched my nipples really hard. Oh, I love that. No. No. I no. do. I like it. I, I know. Well, right, was a 
Oh my god, no. my pink thumb's so. Oh, yes. I love if that. it's nighttime and I'm drunk, it Wait, might put me over the I edge. Not in the on morning. First. I have to be like super well, no, turned on first. and then comes the nipple. Of don't do my nipples first. No, no, god no, no, no. damn it, don't do my nipples first. Thank you, Mary. Yeah. Okay. That's Marianne. That's Marianne. Sorry. Right Marianne. <laughs> Ginger says just fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, <laughs> twist it, lick it, Marianne, and rub Marianne, it down. Marianne, no, Marianne wants well, Marianne it like, likes to be it. turned on and then go <laughs> into the nipples. Okay. All right. uh, you want nipples? Or- Ginger okay. just wants to be fucked. Layla is trying to pass over what Marianne right. wants. No, hold on. All right. We got to move on to our next question. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, we'll go for hours. Um, <clears throat> next <laughs> next question, gals. Ass play. Uh, Who's an ass play fan here? I like my ass licked. Ginger does. Yes. Ginger. Ginger likes yeah. her ass licked and maybe a little bit of finger inside a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Marianne um, likes some lickage, but... Mm. On your lots ass. of lube, lots of lube. On your ass. Yeah. You like you like your you like oh. some butt play. Yes. Okay. Yes. Gentle butt play. Gentle, no. but lots of lube if you want to I, penetrate it. Okay. Lots mm-hmm. of lube. Yeah, that's right. I know. Hey, the dry the dry entry doesn't work. None of that. Mm-hmm. Um, and then um, I think you should blow in the fucking rectum. Blow. <laughs> what? <laughs> blow. <laughs> like. Like air? Oh, uh, yes. What? Wait. What I haven't tried that? that. I've never tried that. <laughs> what? Stop, 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 stop. No. For you or for him? No. I want my ass. I want them to blow. Okay. There's okay. something to be said about a nice, cool breeze. Wait. Like, against you it lick, or like in it? You lick and you suck it and then you... On, on the outside. On the outside. Not, not blowing. Not in. in. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. Because to come out. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> Which, wait, which is getting me onto another <laughs> subject. The, the ginger. The ginger. Wait, okay. We're, get, we're gonna get into everything. Okay. Who's who's past gas? Never. <laughs> me. I never. I. Okay, this is ginger. 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 I was doing ver- reverse cowgirl. <laughs> And I was in Cabo. <laughs> and I was to, we would drink a lot. Yeah, a lot, a lot, a lot. A lot. Yeah. And we had already been fucking. He already had me from behind. And so he was already doing doggy style. So there was already air. Except for the air didn't was come he, out of my that, vagina. What, oh, oh. <laughs> I eat. It wasn't a queef. Seriously, it wasn't a queef. What was it? It stop, was, stop I think I, I, I had injured. some flatu- flatulence. <laughs> I think I may have just like fucking passed gas when I was doing reverse cowgirl. Ah, and it does happen, guys. <laughs> it's, it's, I fuck a lot. It's never happened. I, me. <laughs> I was so fucking embarrassed. Oh I was so embarrassed and he didn't say a fucking word and I didn't say a word and I kept fucking his dick. <laughs> and I nobody said anything. Everybody's just like, let's just blow right past that. <laughs> Sorry, but we had to talk about it. But it does happen. It has nothing to do with anything other than I had no idea it was even coming. I didn't know it was even going to happen. Did he still come? I think he did. And I did. But by the way, I left the next day. I left the next day. Yeah, Yeah, we never talked again. Okay. Ah! All right. Um, I'm going to talk about sex toys. And specifically, I know that Marianne, you have an interesting sex toy story, right? Because... Mm -hmm. Um, didn't you have a dildo that exploded in you? Yes, I did. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? So this is like five years ago when I was like a major stoner, right? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I didn't start smoking weed until I was like of a certain age, like oh, much we older. Okay, we don't talk much older. Uh, much older. Well, much older is like then, 29 No, or yeah, whatever. Yeah. 86, whatever. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, and then, whatever. I was in my, I was in my weed smoking stage. And one of the people that worked for me gave me a plug-in vibrator. Uh-huh. And so I was having fun those times. Like, it wasn't really, you know. Like, were you by yourself? Were you a No, I, was, I, I had a guy. You had a friend. A guy, a friend, a friend. A friend, a friend um, with benefits. And so I, would like, smoked a bunch of weed and we were doing it. And his, oh my God, he had the ginormous wiener <gasps> ginormous oh. 
And so we. Uh, one of the biggest. One of the, one of the biggest. One of the big girth. Because girth is a, my favorite. Beyond girth. girth. Oh, I need girth. <gasps> no. No. One of the no. Biggest. He one can't of have a girth that. No. Big. Beyond like big. that size. Yeah. Like okay. Beyond big. Okay. And so he did. You know, he had already came. He did mm-hmm. come for me. Yeah. And so I thought, oh, you know, I'm going to keep trying. And so I got my vibrator that I plugged into the wall and I'm, you know, going to town. And <laughs> it was so funny. God damn it. Um, so we're going to town and, and he's sitting there trying to, like, participate. And I'm, like, just trying to finish. God damn it. Wait, he's participating. How's he participating? Well, like, what? what? Sucking my doing? nipples. Oh, okay, okay. And sucking okay, my yeah. nipples yeah. and rubbing and, and you're doing jerk, whatever. And you're fucking And I'm trying to get my... I'm like, oh, God, please. I'm yeah. so high. You're I'm so, like, I, you're on the I'm incredibly high. Yeah. And I'm like, I just want to fucking come. <laughs> I just and you're want like, to come. You got the fucking vibrator. Yeah, going. no, I'm the vibrator is Super doing its strong. thing. Yeah. It's yeah. doing its thing. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, something short circuits and fireworks fly out of my crotch. Fireworks! And you're lying. They fly out of sparks. my crotch. No, 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 not sparks. Not in no, you, not sparks. Out of it. Fireworks out of my crotch. Well, I'm high, and I. Cannot stop fucking laughing. I just, you, you, my working crotch just turned into the 4th of July. I'm like, what the fuck is this? My, you, oh, oh my God. Scary. What happened? No, like, everything stopped. It was like fireworks. And, and, and then it just, everything was dead. Did you like and get hurt? Did no, get hurt? I was dying laughing. Are you kidding? Okay. What did you do? So her dildo blew up on her. That's yes, what happened. The gist up. of this. It exploded and in your pussy. And it, it wasn't because you pussy. were having an explosive well, orgasm. It was dark in the room. It wasn't like we were dead in the daylight. It was oh, dark shit. in the room. So it was like, it was the 4th of July coming out of my crotch. And I'm high. So imagine how hard you would laugh. And then what? And then what? Did and then come? what? I give up. Okay. You didn't come? I give up. I yeah. give up. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> After all that, you Wait. didn't have an orgasm? No. Okay. You have to, you have to pay attention okay. here to the, to the right. interviewer. Okay. Who's been with a woman? Oh, well, Ginger. Ginger. Ginger's been with a woman. Yeah. And you lift her pussy. I, how many? How many pussies have you eaten? (laughs) What do they taste like? Wait. Oh my God. I'm sorry. Come on, Marianne. (laughs) I've been with a couple. I've been with a couple. What's a couple? How many? Two. Two. Okay. Um, I mean, I've kissed. I've made well, out with that more. Doesn't, that doesn't yeah. count. Yeah. But I have been with. I've been with two. Okay. You've licked two pussies. Now, did you make them come? I've licked two pussies. I fucked one pussy with my strap on. Okay. Yeah. But the pussies that you licked, did you make them come? Yes. You did. So yes. You're good. So what you do is you do what you like. Right. So I know what Which I is like. What I think women would be yes. good. This so, I, I know what I like, and so I just kind of do yes. what I like. And so, yeah. I know how I want the vibration. How do you like it? Tell me how I know how I like the vibration. I know I like my clit sucked. Okay, wait. I wait. like my clit sucked, and I, I want it sucked right and vibrated yes. on. Can we stop right there? Can oh, stop wait. Right? wait yeah. I have to make a point. I have to make a point. I don't understand why guys don't fucking get this. Stop watching fucking porno. My husband does. Lick. And so uh, it's the Hoover that shit. Hoover, Hoover the hell. It. You know we um, don't want like we don't want need, it like fucking sucked on. I don't need Suck your on face it. going side to side, north, south, east, west, like okay. you're, like you're trying to cover the whole United so States. So might Marianne Let's Skipper get in there and suck that shit. Marianne okay, Skipper said does this please. thing where he like sucks it in, and then my husband, your husband, yeah, you Skipper. Right? Skipper. We're calling him Skipper. We're not gonna Marianne. Call him. Right, yeah. Skipper. He sucks it in his mouth and then he goes like a little bit of the stuff. Uh-uh. And sucks a little bit of the Oh. Uh-uh. Beyond. No, uh-uh. no, 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 no. No. Trust me, it is amazing. Oh, you like it? Yes. No. He. Oh. oh. No, sucking. Oh, sucking. Oh, he sucks. does suck it. He sucks. And then he sucks. licks. Yes. He uh, sucks. No, sucks. Yeah, yeah, he sucks. Sucks it in, in yeah. where it's like tight and like sucked in, and it's like, oh, <laughs> yes. Okay, that's good. amazing. I, uh, I know. Well, the first so time you ever got it, it in, sucking it in. There we go. Cheers to Skipper. Cheers to Skipper. First time you ever right did it, I was Skipper. like, what the? Are you doing? Yeah. How do you know 
to do and that. And he's younger, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Younger than me. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. My husband, guys, my husband is younger than me. Where and her husband, no her husband's a freak. He likes to freak it, freak it with her. He I likes know. it. He, likes he wants it. his wife to freak it. That's yes. amazing. I love it. Okay. okay, so we want to suck it. You guys You've need to suck the clit. I've yeah. been with a few and I've fucked. Ginger's been with a few. Okay. Yeah. And, you, and tell me about the strap-on portion of that, <laughs> of those encounters. <clears throat> Okay, well, do we want to know about the strap on that I put on for the guy or the strap on I put on for the. <laughs> I love Ginger. Oh, I love it. Ginger. Because you Does little fuckers. Nice... How about you guy? I mean, okay, so here's the thing the don't guys. Make... We're nice not fu guys. Okay, We're I'm nice sorry. Guys. I don't mean to call you that. You're not. Ginger's, you're not that. Ginger's been but it, I, I've had some. Um, what? Duck corn. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> You yeah, guys, fine. it's that's okay fine. if you guys want to have some play with your asshole and have it from a female. That's totally all right. Because there's a lot of you guys that want your you want your asshole to be played ask with. It's okay, you can mix it. Well, right. we're talking about what I did with the girls. Yeah, there we go. It was in Vegas. Oh, you were at a sex... Oh, you were no. At no, I wasn't. Just I was Vegas. just, we were just in Vegas. Crazy things happen and in Vegas. we were in Vegas, yeah. and my friend and I and some other people, and we <laughs> were drinking a lot. And the next thing you know, the guy, it was ended up being a threesome. Mm -hmm. And one thing led to another, and I just kind of put a strap on, and I fucked. You pegged him? No. No, her. her. I've picked okay. her. See, but that would not be bad, yeah. though. Like, if it was a but girlfriend. But she's super sexual. Like, uh -huh. it's a friend of mine that's super, super sexual. She's not somebody that I've known forever. She's someone I've known for, like, five years. Yeah. And the way that I met her, like, in the single arena, and she's super sexual. Okay. So it, it all kind of made sense. Yeah, sure. Because I don't know her in the, like, how I know Marianne or, you know. It, yeah. It was a different environment. And right. so doing that was except like it was like no problem making her like have an orgasm, and she had one. She had did it several. Did it turn you on when she? Did? Yeah, yeah, totally. Yeah, but yes. I mean, well, I think it's hot. I mean, actually, yeah. I, do, I think that's. I mean, like mm -hmm. if, if someone else is it just just in any sexual act when when you're. Whoever the but she's is. super super sexual. Yeah. She's got really big, huge natural breasts, uh -huh. and she's. Really pretty, and she yeah. she loves sex like there I do. You go. So we both Good for it, her. it worked. You like her? Okay. It worked. All right. Now, so I haven't been with a woman. Every, you know, the, uh, the listeners know that. And Marianne, you have not. No. But you used to tell me that you wanted a woman to go down on you. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Absolutely. That's just never happened. Mm -hmm. No. If you had the opportunity, which I think Skipper should. If yes. the circumstances were right. If Skipper's there. If Skipper's there, yeah. no. Well, this would be the perfect situation. Skipper's there. Yeah. And me. And we meet some random. Like, I can't know her. Right. You're never going to see yeah, her again. No. That's um, what I see. You know, right. I can never her see her again. Yeah. And so then we meet some girl. She's my, our third. In Spain, let's say. And <laughs> put it out there. In the, put it out there in the universe, okay. and it will happen. Right. I'm gonna put be the there in three days, and so, so is she. And exactly. So, yeah, yeah. 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 So we, you know, yeah. do whatever, and I could make out with her. Uh -huh. I could lick her nipples. Yeah. That would all turn me off. Above yeah. The waist that would place. all okay. turn me yeah. off. Yeah. And then she could only go down on me. Yeah. And like do whatever. And Skipper could watch. Could it. only watch. He could only watch. Yeah. He cannot f her. He could not, you know, do whatever with her. But, um. Oh, thank you. Um. But he could watch all of it. Yeah, he could watch all of it. There. So I'll, Skipper could watch I'll all of it. Um. He could maybe kiss her. Maybe. No. No. Probably not. This thing's too Skip, personal. No. Skipper no, can No. He doesn't need to kiss her. Skip, Fuck that. Skipper can watch. He can fucking smack well, her ass or walk, something. Right. No. He's not going to kiss her. He no. can maybe smack her ass. Right. No. He can no, smack her no ass. No. No kissing. Yeah. Yeah. This thing's too fucking personal. Mm -hmm. okay. Don't let his lips touch her fucking oh, body. Oh, wait. Hold on. And the other oh. thing I would do is I would scissor oh. with her. Scissor. <gasps> oh! Do you want to scissor with her? Is that grinding? I can you both oh. Is that grinding? <laughs> Mary Ann wants to bump her. Oh. You want to bump? You want to rub clit? I, I can come. scissor with her, yes. Oh. Yeah. I've never scissored. I've never scissored. I've never scissored. 
I would scissor. I never scissor. Mary, I'm a scissor. I am not a girl. Yeah. But I haven't scissored. I know. I, see, uh, yeah. I can scissor. I'm going to scissor. Oh, do you scissor? Okay, that's on my bucket list. Here we go. Okay. Add, Add it. it. Add Thank it. You, Mary. I'm Thank scissoring. You. Okay. Okay. Very All right. Good. Cheers to scissoring. Here we go. Cheers. All right. All right. All right. Now, who's had some BBC? Mm. 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 Never. Just, two, just just myself and. Wait. Mary can you Anne? say what it is again? Um. Well, he was half. Yeah. So was mine. <laughs> he was a half black. Okay. I don't know how big he was though. I don't think he was that big. He wasn't like. It wasn't like a really big one, okay. <clears throat> like a like a really black. No, I was in love with my purple. guy. No, yeah. Oh, you were. You, remember oh, you? That I was his boyfriend. Oh, you oh, met him. I, I know. I loved him. Oh, he was big. Uh, he was a big dude. Tall. How was that? Yeah. That's why you loved him because it was a big black. The dick. lower half was white. Oh. oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then it wasn't the BBC. It wasn't. I've had bigger. It was long oh, and like thick. It was... The lower half was white. Then oh. it's not. Okay. I loved him though. You did. But no, but I've had bigger. Yeah. yeah. I've had bigger white guys. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. But he wasn't a big black It was black. Not what Isn't I thought that, that is. I was afraid of it at black first. Yeah, yeah. So I want to say, okay, so. I, oh. Don't touch my mouth. I haven't had a big black <laughs> hawk. No. I need to have it. I need to have it. Okay, so so on Can I have it? Yeah. Okay. I think I'm gonna have it. On my sex bucket list, one of the things I wanted to do was I'd never been with an African American guy. Okay, I have I wanted to do that. And I did. And actually I still see him. His name is D. I he's on my, you know, on on the website with the guys. Um he's a lot of fun. He's a great he's great sexually, and he just happens to have a huge Huge one. I think mm. I'm gonna try to think here. It's because it's it's I think it's long, not too long, because you know we're all the internally from from Our your cervix from your will start. Yourself, we're all the same, like right. No, thinning. I don't want it long. No, I want it like no. thick. That's, That's what, what like long and like his it's is, good, his but is, his is thick, but his is girthy. Nice and girthy. Mm -hmm. That's the best. And so... Yes, and girth is the best. So, so there's a stereotype out there that, you know, African American guys have really thick cocks. Mm -mm. And it just so happened that I, you know, the, the, the first guy, that the first African American guy I've been with, D, has a really nice thick one. And it's very fun and I do enjoy it. Except for blowjobs are really hard because you... It's really, it's hard to do. And poor, Is it that thick? It's that thick. You cannot, like, it's just hitting your teeth. I mean, it has nowhere to go. You're like, ah, you can't get it in there. So. Oh. There you do it. <laughs> Show you me how ah. <laughs> <laughs> You try. You try your best. You just, it's like, you do what you can. You, I mean, I, I'm sure there's techniques. I'm just, you know, I, I've got my BBC training wheels on, so I don't know. Um, okay. We talked about, let's see, uh, we're, 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 Oh, now I know anybody here. I anybody here besides me been to sex, sex parties or swingers parties? Hi. Of course, Ginger. <clears throat> Ginger. Ginger. Mary. Ginger. Ginger, Ginger is Mary a little Ginger. slut. Ginger's been to a sex party in yeah. several cities. Yes, good for you. Well, Mom. Mary, I want to go to the one that Ginger recommended in yeah Miami. Well, and Miami and Velvet. It's yeah. a good one. It's yeah. a good one. It's a good one because they're good-looking people. Yeah. What? The bit. No, wait. You cannot take a potty break. <laughs> you have to hold it, girl. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on. We just had someone. We just had. What are we talking about? We just had someone try to get up and take a potty break. No, there's no potty breaking right now, unless it's a subject that you don't know. Okay, so I don't know that I've one. Been, so well, I, what I've are we talking my, about? I've been to my first sex or swingers party, sex party, I call it. <clears throat> It was it, but I understand what you're saying. You need to go I, to the, we, and we're not on, we're not on that coast. We're not on the, uh. Okay, we're going to go to one. We're going to go. Okay, yeah. that's on our, we're going to And go. I met somebody at one oh. who tried to date me, and then I got chlamydia. Oh. Then. I got chlamydia for my first husband. I got so. chlamydia. Whatever. I got chlamydia. 
Oh, Jesus. I got chlamydia from a guy from a... So, a Mary party. Ann got chlamydia from her first husband. And Mary Ann Ginger got chlamydia from a guy she met at a sex party when she fucked Lido. him later. No, no, no. Hold on. Layla. Oh. Chlamydia. All right. Hold on. We're not talking no. about that. And I Ginger. It. I got it. I got it. I got it. And I told him, and he's like, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it was like no skin off his back. What happens when you get chlamydia? And... I just got tested for it. I didn't have what anything. What happens downtown? What happens mm-hmm. down in... What happens to your it vagina? It hurts. It's just kind of like a little bit what? painful. And it's you go, a little How icky. do you know you have it? It's it kind hurts. Of icky. Does it get funky? No, it fucking hurts. It hurts? Yes. No, it, it, didn't, hurt. it didn't hurt me. It was just a... Well, how um, did you know you had it? Tell okay. me what the symptoms are. Hold on a second. Let me think about this for a second. How did I have it? This is hilarious. I never knew you guys had. <laughs> yes, chlamydia oh God, is wait. super Hold on. common. What? Chlamydia is super common, and when you're going around and fucking, you gotta use condoms. I don't think I used a condom with him when I started dating him, and then he told oh, me dating. I. Okay. Yeah, well. This isn't it. Yeah. I mean, I, I mean, he was. He wanted to be my boyfriend yeah. and yeah. whatever, but he wanted to have an open relationship. Oh, open. You can't do that. With open him. because he would like to go to swingers and. What's happening? Nothing's live, right? No. <clears throat> What's happening? Okay. Um. Let's see. So, oh, oh, I got it. Oh, here's okay? a question. Here's a question. Okay, now we're, we're, we're moving off of that okay. one. Okay. Yeah, good. Go. All right. Who's anybody double booked? Who's double booked? Oh, two guys in one day? Yeah. Like when I was 20. Who was it? Um, I... I, An old boyfriend and a whatever, but yeah, no, I've, I've I've had two in one day. Yeah, I've you had two in one day. Yeah, I've had three yes. in one day. You triple booked. I triple booked. I, I Ginger's a little slut. Ginger, I didn't realize Ginger. That. Okay, Mary Ginger's a bad booked. girl. <laughs> Ginger has triple Ginger's booked. a bad girl. <laughs> Layla is double booked, but it's been a while. I mean, I haven't triple That's, booked. I haven't done that in a while. Cool. It's been a while. Yeah. It's been a while. Okay. So who? What are your favorite sex toys? Hmm. A Smurf. So boring. I'm so boring. You still have a Smurf? No, it's I, not. No, I no, have no. a Smurf. I have Papa Smurf. Well, let's talk no. about Smurf. Papa Smurf, Smurf is Smurf. a blue dildo. No, I just, I, just like, like, I just need some, like, major, like, you not, still major, not, like, the... some simple vibrating on, like, my clit, and then I'll, That's like, all come. You need. Yeah. Well, then you could just get a tiny um, little uh, um, bullet. Yeah. No, I know. You don't need, like, you don't need the penetration. You need the clit. You know what, though? Like, my clitoris is, like, hypersensitive. I feel like I need, like, some doctor stuff. Like, you got, I feel like so many people have so much more fun than I do. Sexually? I don't think Mm so. I think you have fun. I I think you're having fun. Because you, because you, are you feeling like you're, you're it's hypersensitive. Like, even when, even when Skipper and I have sex, I'm like, don't get too, you know, like, don't touch it too much. Like, it... Oh. Yeah, it's, it's hypersensitive. Oh. Mm-hmm. You don't want him to touch it? Yeah, it gets oh like... Oh, my God. Well, then like, what? Touch it, rub it, lick it, suck it. Oh. oh. I, I, I've always got... No, it. it's like almost like... Oh. And my nipples, too. <gasps> Really? Mm-hmm. You don't want him to do too much of it because it's too much. It makes you kind of like, gee. Yeah. 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 Like, it's too much. Like, mm-hmm. oh, it's making me kind of... Yeah. How do you know that? Stimulant. How do you know that? What about you? I know. Ginger. No, no. I want the Ginger stimulation. Ginger does not I care. Know, me too. I want like I, stimulation. I think stimulation. I, think I might want stimulation. Yeah. I think I might. Okay. I think I might. What's the kinkiest, like, <clears throat> what do you guys consider like the kinkiest thing you've ever done? <laughs> Ginger's going to have some stories. Let's start with you, Marianne, because it might be low key. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to tell you the kink is? Yes. That's what I asked. That's what I want. Okay. The kinkiest. Many, many, many years ago. I, I had a guy that literally wanted to swallow my urine. Oh, you've been peeing. You've, you've been peeing on. Okay, you like to but, pee too. The water sports, they call it. Okay. He wanted to but he urine. wanted to drink. Uh-huh. Drink the urine. As you were peeing, as it was coming. I had to, I had to, like, literally squat. Uh-huh. 
over his mouth. Him and your MP. Uh huh. Uh huh. In his mouth. Yeah. Jesus. <clears throat> you are one kinky bitch. No, for sure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, Absolutely. You know, sure, you knew me. it. You I know, know it. I know. Fully, but that's yeah. what I had to do a long uh-huh. time ago. Yeah. And I did it only but, one. Mm-hmm. I only did it with him one time. Yeah. It was not comfortable. Yeah. You, I wasn't comfortable. You don't want to do that. And right. when you're when you are squatting over a guy's face and you have to urinate in his <laughs> mouth. It's hard to aim. Well, <laughs> not only that, but you have to be like oh, God, I, gotta, I have to like urinate. Yeah, right. And then you're having performance anxiety. Yes. Yes. Where yes. I was having... Ginger. Ginger is running Gin- off the table. Ginger, we're going to talk about you because we... Marianne. Or, sorry. Marianne. I'm sorry. Marianne just left the table. She's got to pee. Okay. Well, speaking... Well, you're she might so, be having... That's because you're talking so much about going pee. Yeah. Okay. But that was probably the kinkiest. If you're going to think about kinky, yeah. other than a, uh-huh. a champagne bottle going at me. You've, had, you've been fucked with I've the champagne bottle? I've been fucked with the champagne bottle. Did, was that, did that feel good? Yeah. Did it really? Yeah, we were really... That's too gentle. We were really... Uh-huh, uh-huh. I mean, you have to be... Yeah. yeah. We were really having like a threesome, and I was kind of a... Okay. It was a little bit different. Now, you also said earlier something I picked up on. You said that you like... <laughs> being peed on. Is that right, Ginger? Yes. <laughs> yes. Ginger likes Okay, me. listen. Let's clarify this. Well, Urine is super, super clean. Hey, I know it's clean, wait. but do you want to lick it and eat no, it? No, stop. I don't eat it, and listen. I don't lick it. I didn't, guys, I've never eaten it. Ladies, you don't ladies, eat it, ladies. and you don't swallow. You just Hold on. let it, like, wait, fall I on you. Okay. Because it's really warm and hot Wait, and it's on, clean. Before we get going on that, what I want to say is there's a lot of people that listen with a lot of different fetishes. There's a lot of fetishes and kinks out there. I, we're not, I'm not... I have broadened my horizons. I mean, I never say never, although I could say I probably would You know, there's certain things I probably maybe wouldn't do. However, people looked at... This is not uncommon. So, Marianne, it's not... This is what she's talking about. It's not uncommon. Mm-hmm. Okay, Ginger. <clears throat> So it's what are we clean. talking about? We know, we know that urine's clean, and you've been, you've, you, uh, someone has, was into that, and you were partaking in the... What? Having urine? Yeah. All over me? Water in my sports. mouth, in my face, on my tits? Yeah. Yeah. Were you in the shower when you did this? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. easy now. So yeah. you get, yeah. you get in there. Mm-hmm. And you're making out or whatever, and you, maybe you shut the water off. And they have to go to the, they have, they have an urge to urinate and you just kind of let it seep from right here down. Now, is this a fetish of yours? I didn't think it was. I don't think it's a fetish. I think it's, it's kind of maybe, yeah. Because it's a little bit of a dominating. So when we talk about being dominated and being an alpha female and then being dominated by a male, I think it's a little bit of a domination thing. From a male. Right. Where sure. it's like, I'm going to fucking... He's working his character. I own you. Right. And it's not really... And you don't swallow, by the no. way. You no. let it just drip out. Uh-huh. Yeah. And you let it drip out of your mouth uh-huh. and onto your breast. Uh-huh. And they might want to do it on your breast yeah. and on your stomach. And maybe even around your... Vagina. Vagina. And a lot of guys can't do it because they get kind of stage fright. And they can't urinate. That makes makes sense. That makes sense. They can't urinate because they're all, like, nervous. Right. I bet. I bet. It's only happened sometimes. Okay. (laughs) Where are you going there, Marianne? I'm getting my lip gloss. She can't. (laughs) I'm getting my lip gloss for the podcast. (laughs) This isn't a a video. I'm getting my lip gloss. Okay. Okay. You guys have... Okay. (laughs) Oh my god, we're getting what okay. You had um did you have questions for me? I had a question for you. Mm-hmm. Yes. Go ahead, please, the Marianne. Ask away. Do you ever get emotionally attached to these men? Yes. Oh, and what do you think? What? To who are you oh, most? Oh no, I won't No. I, that's a rule. I don't talk about I don't everyone so it's very common for people to ask me who my favorite is, blah, blah, blah. And I don't get into that. However, if you read the um, blog, you know. Could you see 
any of these men. (laughs) Yes, go ahead. There we go. (laughs) As your partner for the rest of your life, could you Marriage potential? Who gets married anymore? Really? Or you? Well, I did because I had babies. No. You didn't have babies and you you loved you. That's Did you see it. any of these guys for the rest of your I life? I might need to open up the bottle. Um, probably. Uh uh-uh. uh. Expand. Expand, please. <laughs> oh, you put me in the hot seat. Expand. Um, probably. And why do you say probably? What is that one thing? That feels really about good on our lips. I know. Okay. What's that one thing about them that you would say probably? Oh, I got a good one. I got a good one. Okay, hold on, hold on now. Okay, you guys, you guys are putting me in the hot seat. That's good. I like that. Okay. You're going to be in the hot seat, fucker. Hot seat, fucker. Hot seat, fucker. <laughs> I'm in the fucker. hot seat. Okay. Can you give me some more wine? <laughs> okay. Ginger, can you open another bottle while I'm answering Marianne's question? I, I didn't even listen to this. Okay. No, go get um, the water. You can listen. You can listen. Cheers. Here we go. Are we cheersing? Yeah, because we're giving her a sip. Cheers. Sip on. You need to drink your fucking shit. I know. You're you guys have, I've had this. You're not even drinking. I know. Hello. Because I have to keep my wits about Ginger. me. I'm the interviewer. I'm the host of the show. Okay. Can I see myself with somebody? Is that what she said? Or what was the what was the qualifying question? Yeah, I'd love to see you with somebody. <gasps> oh, Mary Ann. Here in oh. Gilligan's Island. <laughs> you want me to you, you want me to yeah. get married? No. Not, no, not married. No. no. Just, just not happily like, ever after. You want me to have uh like a- Happily mm. ever after. You want me to have happily We ever. always want that for our friends. Because we not love married. I don't want you to get married. I don't want you no, to get married. No, just either. happily ever after. Someone that you can be like, let's go to fucking Cabo and let's all yeah. go together. No, we live together. We do whatever. We but like, all, let's all go together and it, it, make it a like a Not union. Okay. Just a happily ever after. Yeah. Well, you mean someone that you, you want to be in love? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You want to be in love. Mm-hmm. And you're asking me, do I think that, that I could be in love with one of these for so, the rest of your life, mm-hmm, and we're not talking mm-hmm. about the next six <laughs> years. I'm talking about no, I'm a short term. Yeah, you want to say like, do I? Can I see myself? This is the thing I was asking. Can oh, I see myself holding so hands with them on a park bench when I'm 85? Mm-hmm. No. no, no. She's no. asking if you. I don't think that's realistic. No, it is. It oh, is. I. I mean. Stay focused. <laughs> Stay fo- okay, what's the question? You want to know if I could be in love with one of these guys? That's yeah. Um. Mm. Yes. And Maybe. In lo- by in love, I mean <laughs> like I'm- forever. I mean like for- like Skipper and I. Skipper and I like you know met mm. kind of late. You in weren't life expecting that. You weren't expecting baby. it. We were never. Expect- you weren't expecting it. And- you weren't expecting yeah. to be with Skipper. You're buying sex toys and right, and you want to make him happy, right. and yes. you want to make I him happy. Yeah. yeah. So, had Skipper and I not, not oh, wanted babies, I never would want to get married. Right. Like, we got married because I wanted babies, and so that all worked out. But mm-hmm. at this I, stage I, in I life, mean, I would have been mm, very, very happy with yeah. um, God, somebody who I just wanted to do the same things in life with. Yes. You know? Like, and... Yeah, and, a partner. And marriage would not have mattered. Yeah. You okay. have babies. Right. Baby but girls. when you have babies, you're like, okay, so yeah. we gotta... Yeah. Yeah, so I think I, 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 think I just answered that, yeah. Yeah. I said yes. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Anything else? I have a Marianne? question. Marianne, you keep going. Are you done? I know. I knew you guys would get, like, into the question. Okay. <laughs> All the stuff that I won't ask. Ha- I have a question. Go ahead, Ginger. How long do you wait to have sex with these guys, or when do you know if you no. even want Doesn't to have matter. sex with them? Doesn't matter. Oh, how long do I wait? Well, I want to know because I'm in the situation yeah. where I'm trying to decide if I want to have sex with somebody. Okay. But I've been out with three times. Oh. And all he talks about is sex. And I don't know if I want him just for sex or I don't know if I want him. I'm gonna, Or I don't know if I want to just uh-huh. get. Marianne, get your ass back no. in Oh, I know, but we're going to be done pretty soon. We're gonna- so how do you. How do you how do you determine those. how long you're gonna wait, or do you determine if you're gonna wait, or do is it a by the moment? If you're gonna have sex with them, 
Because I'm trying to put off this guy and I'm trying to play hard to get. And I want to <laughs> fuck. I want to fuck yeah. the shit out of him. I okay. want to fuck him so bad. Right, hold on, hold on. And I don't know if I want him for long term. Okay. Or, or okay, I don't that's, know. that's the important part. That's the important okay. part. Okay. Okay. So, as far as, you know, this whole, my whole little sexual road trip. Because this is all about, for me, sex and exploring. Yeah. What I, you know. No holds barred, just doing it. Whatever I want. Whatever okay. I feel in the moment, I act on. Okay. Okay. Now, now I if but you're but, but but it sounds like what we have here is two different scenarios. If you think you like this guy, so I would say let me let me let me let let me put on my old Layla shoes and a I always made the guy work for it. I still make the guys work for it because men are conquerors and they need to conquer. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And if they can't do that, they're really the wrong person for me anyway. That's number one. But number two is if you, you know, if if the outcome from this that you just most desire is you want to have the mind-blowing, crazy, fun sex mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and you want to act that out in any way you want, then you could do that on the first night. And certainly with, you know, many of these guys, I have and do and, and right. make no bones about it. You right, know? right, right, right. I'm here to fuck. Right. Um, <clears throat> so it just, it really depends on, you know, which way you want it to go. Now, surprisingly though, I'm going to ex- expand on that a little bit. So, it doesn't always kill, it's not always a killer, like, of where it could potentially go. No, because you don't know. Yeah. If you just, but again, like, if you, but if you want to be sexual, sexual. We're sexual beings. We're very sexual, be sexual beings. Yeah. And you feel like you're ready to go, then just do it. But you kind of have to know that. Yeah. You do run the risk of them maybe just kind of being doing like, a regular guy thing. Now, right. Now, that, uh, uh, I can tell you that for me, that doesn't happen because these guys know what I'm there for, and then they want to kind of continue doing that. And then, the, then it's like we put it in reverse. Yeah. We do the sex first, and then, every, and then, and then things everything are building go- yeah. from there. It's been interesting that way. Yeah, yeah. It's been very interesting that way. Yeah. Because when you're in control as a sexual female, and you're just like, yes. I'm here to fuck. I'm, and I don't make any bones about it. Yeah. They don't I don't really. Know really... Uh, the truth is, they don't know. I'm, they don't get that a lot. That's the truth. Yeah. And then they're going to be like, oh, oh, wait well, oh, 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 right. Hey, hey, hey. hey yeah. Know, it's different. It really kind of is. Yeah. So, I get that. I get that. Um, mm-hmm. That's, did I answer that? Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know what that fucking question is. Can you read your own writing? I can't find since... I don't know what that says. I don't either. I'm trying to Let read it. Let me see if I can read what you wrote. I don't think so. I don't think you um, can read it. I think it's more that how do you know when you're going to, like... Because yeah. when you've come out of a relationship... I think and you're then coming you go, out of a... I'm coming out you're of You're coming out of a relationship. Get, get Marianne back in here. Come on. You're coming out of a relationship, relationship and yeah. therefore... And I don't want another one. I want to just have some... What you have to do is, um, if you want to go out and play and have fun, go out and play and have fun. Yeah. And don't I think have so. any expectation of, right. that's your time, that's all about you. Right. And, you know, just I think so. do what you want to do, and then... There right. you go. And then, and then you'll decide from there. Do you have another question? Are you done? Yes, another question. Are you done? Oh, wait, is everybody done? Wait, wait, wait. No, I'm not done. I just have to go to the bathroom. Wait. Like that. Well, we can't. We need to stop. We're, it's, we're in 45 minutes now. All right. So you're either going to ask it or we're just... It's okay. We can be done. Yeah, I just have to go to the bathroom. Um, <clears throat> I think we're done. I... I know. I mean, I think this has been really amazing. <laughs> you guys are fun. Here, let's cheers. We got to cheers. Okay. Sorry, we're going to end the podcast. Right? All right. Thank you so much for doing this. Thanks, you guys. guys. You know, you actually, you know, Ginger. Ginger. We have a lot more to talk yes, about. Yes, but, but, you know, this one, since high Marianne. school. Marianne. Marianne. Me. And you in my 20s. We're, yeah. Was, yeah. 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 a long 
let's talk. But I got married and I've been I, doing lot, shit well, and we've reconnected happened. here and there. Yeah, I know. A lot and my that. ex-husband. Okay, we won't talk about that. We're yeah. ending this. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, on that note. Thank I'm not you guys. Know. Everybody, thank you for listening. Questions or comments, you know what to do. And we're giving you kisses from Marianne and Ginger. And uh, hopefully you enjoyed that. All right. Bye. Thanks so much for listening. And if you like what you hear, refer me to a friend. And make sure you're following me on social media. Also, go to the website, thecuriousgirldiaries.com, and join my subscribers only list for access to exclusive content. And as usual, questions or comments, you can always email me at curiousgirl at thecuriousgirldiaries.com.